Hi everyone, uh, this video will show you how to um, make changes to your Safari preference or settings so that you can allow for cross-site tracking. So first what you need to do is obviously um, open Safari and this should work uh, for Safari that is um, I think starting 2021 um, when Safari um, installed or have the cross-site uh, tracking prevention. So uh, first thing you need to do is uh, open Safari and then go to file, no, sorry, go to the Safari menu and then go to preferences. Uh, or you can just uh, simply uh, uh, press command and comma from your keyboard. And once you do, uh, mine is already unchecked, but uh, if your browser has not been adjusted, it will look like this. Uh, by default, it does prevent cross-site tracking. Um, and what you need to do, obviously, is uncheck it so that you would allow cross-site tracking. Cross-site tracking uh, will allow um, other websites, other services from other websites even, uh, to be able to... Um, relay or track information while uh, being or when, while you are browsing other websites. Uh, so that is exactly what is called cross-site. Uh, when you are accessing different site, you're able to uh, still track um, coming from a different site, you know, information, cookies, etc. So we need this for um, the BNH, uh, some of the BNH services, such as the affiliate Stripe. Uh, easy bookmarklet and um, even the easy link for Chrome even though Chrome doesn't really have a problem right now with cross-site but it may in the future um, we need to have those um, cross-site uh, allowed because we keep and track information for your KB and BI num across the different URLs and, and domains that you access um, if you have any question, you can uh, contact your affiliate manager, but um, if you are using Safari and you're having login issues in regards to your KBID and BINUM, make sure that this settings right here is unchecked. Once it's unchecked, there is no save button for Safari. All you do is just close it and you can start using uh, the affiliate stripe or the easy bookmarklet, etc. Thank you for watching.